Hi there, welcome to Human Hangout with Kofi the Guru. I'm your host with the most. And yes, this is another fantastic episode. See, this episode is bionic, as in episonic, sclufic, as in hey. By the time you watch this episode, oh, one of the most versatile episodes you're going to watch. You know, you, as in, you just forget every other thing, your problem, your, you know. I'm talking about forget. Have you ever stepped into a room and you just suffer, you know, a glitch? Like, you know, there are days that you glitch. You know, like computer will just do anyhow. Human beings will do it too. You just walk into a room. You were going there for a specific purpose. And then you get into the room and you forgot why you came there. You just be looking around. Ah, why did I come here? Why did I come here? Just know that gradually you are getting to that part where you cross over. Because in fact, it is for a fact that the older you get, the more these specific three things happen to you. One, you start to lose your memory. I've forgotten the remaining two. But then, in this day and age, some people expect me to know everything all at once. It took about a millennia for our ancestors to be able, in fact, it took them up to now about 20, 20 years to be able to know dates. And you expect me, this young person, in this young life, to know everything I need to know in six, three, three, four, six years of primary education three years of first secondary education, three years of the remaining second, and then four years of university. You expect me to know everything that it took my ancestors a millennium to know on your own. So, and then people keep arguing, um, uh, who is the strongest of men? I am the strongest. I'm, uh, one said I'm a minor, you know, we're strong. One said I'm a lumberjack, we're strong. One said I'm well, uh, uh, the strongest of men is a gynecologist. You know why? Despite what he sees constantly, all day at work, he must still stay like that when he gets home with his wife. If not, he will have been considered as a cheat. So he must stay strong. Ah, you understand? <laughs> and that's the show. We're starting right now. Stay here, don't go anywhere. It's Humor Hangout. Remember, focus on your focus. Everybody has a target. Hi, my name is Yabojo, and you're watching Humor Hangout with Kofi Daguru. Okay, you're welcome back to Humor Hangout with Kofi Daguru, your host for the most. Okay. Mm. I told you today was going to be very, very uh, magnetic and very, very... Um, I'm looking for that word. Very spontaneous very um, creative and very dynamic yes that's the word not the comedian dynamic but very dynamic <laughs> because my guest oh oh chill socks oh chill socks my guest is the most dynamic right now on any level creatively in the nigerian creative space one too many area boy father mother daughter hold up she's everybody <laughs> and she's steady killing it you know why because she produces and directs and then edits herself hey <laughs> the only person that could have done that was tyler but someone has beat tyler to it in nigeria welcome with me on humor hunger my sister my friend my baby tauma hey you said tau Thank you, sir. <laughs> it's a tau tau. You are just towing us with different <laughs> You are swinging us with different things. skills. Thank on you, every sir. Wait, you took out time to learn how to edit. Yes. By force or by will or by wit. What inspired you and girls to want to say, okay, um, girls are doing makeup. Or for me, it is edit me. I'm going to go and do how. I don't know. Maybe because I saw a blood doing it and I had that interest. That was my main plan to learn how to edit. I didn't think I was going to do comedy. So Yeah, I know I'm coming to that. I, yeah. I know the history, I know the trajectory. So exactly. Abula will be the man in her life, my video, music video editor and director. So I remember 2015 he wanted to make a video for me. I said, please, 
So can I shoot some excerpts to the intro of the video? I have my girlfriend can do the intro, we'll do something and put. I said, do, do, enjoy, go and do. And then they did an intro to Ilule Okozo video. Yeah. And then I saw this skinny gay doing newscaster. <laughs> so I just watched and said, okay, fine. I didn't bother. I didn't. He was expecting me to react. So I was like, ah, sir, you didn't say anything about. It. I said no. I he didn't know. like uh, it. Uh, do, do you like? I'm, it's okay. I thought you were going to come and say complain, but well, I just know she's very skinny, but it's alright. <laughs> he didn't tell me that. Uh, because it was inconsequential, really. I don't think he even remembered. I don't care so long as it translates into the video. Yeah. It was a beautiful job. Fast forward, a few maybe two years or so later. I wanted to start doing some sketch around Mutan with his area, area girlfriend and all that. Yeah. And I asked people to please if they are interested. And she sent me a message in my DM that I missed until a year later when I saw that ah, Tao wanted to be Mutan's girlfriend. I didn't know. Yeah. So I'm shocked that Tao that was just JJ and JJ sitting and looking at everybody just woke up one day and picked up a character. And then you wowed the whole world. What exactly made you leave editing keyboard to now say, okay, let me face camera and show myself? Um, okay, it was mainly because, yeah, the editing. In order to learn how to edit, I needed some things for myself to, to practice with. So the only way I could get those clips practiced with is, you know, come up with something for myself. And Abla was like, why don't you come up with Mama Tao and Tao character? So that was how I came up with it. And while I was doing those things, all I was concerned about is perfecting my editing skills. Not how it would be with the audience. As in like, like, sometimes destiny can take a different route. You, I tell people sometimes you go this way before you can get this way. So yeah. people will insist on this way, this way, this way. Maybe if you had become Muta's girlfriend, we probably wouldn't have hit it off. As Mama Tao, maybe whilst we were doing Muta and Muta's girlfriend, Amutia, maybe might not have been so impressive. But you going out on your own. And by the way, the characters she reenacted are her own family. 50%. <laughs> are you sure it's 50%? Yeah, 50%. Are I just sure? add my own spice. You slept and wake up and decided to be an area boy again. <laughs> <laughs> it was just, I don't know. I think that day I was looking for someone to act that character. And I didn't see. And then I decided, wow, well, uh, I can't do it. Remember on Instagram <laughs> Live, I was asking you how many characters are there? I don't it was know. On Instagram Live, this area boy came. Yeah, I can, I, it was kind of tough that day. Yeah, because I was being taught how to speak and all those things. But I came out with it, yeah. Ah! <laughs> how? What did you study again? Tourism, hospitality, and events management. <laughs> what did you say you studied? Tourism. You studied tourism. Yeah. And you're touring with characters. Exactly. You know? <laughs> so, which character is in your head now that we've not seen? I'm very sure there must be. I think uh, what determines the character is like the story. Because sometimes you just come up with that a different give to story. You the ability to write amazing scripts. That one I give it to you. I give that one to you. Amazing. Thank ability you. to copy someone's dress code for the day. <laughs> I was dressed like this and you came exactly blue pants, white feet. It was just coincidence. Yeah, it's a mere coincidence. The I difference just... now is this thing that I don't have on my head. <laughs> it's still white so <laughs> <laughs> it's matching. Uh, uh, I must say you are a serious inspiration for a lot of the young ones out there now. Who, but I like the fact that you make it very unique and interesting at the same time and um, a lot of intelligent stuff goes in there and then that you have gone to school that also helps a lot yes. um what is that special thing about you that people don't know ah uh, i think they know i like food that's like <laughs> that that's... can't be it it's not possible <laughs> that's no, no, not, not the way you are this way that's that makes it special because i like food and i eat a lot and you don't really see it in my body. Wait, <laughs> you, don't, eat a lot. you don't see it in my body. That's a special thing. Because a lot of people want to keep eating and not get fat. And that's like something that I have. It's so. a blessing for us. You know, <laughs> you know, we eat and we're here. We'll be like this for a long time. For a long time. You know, and, you know, Fresh. Yeah. Okay, we'll be back. We'll still here. We'll hang out. We'll cook with that girl. I'm here with Taoma, my sister. And we're having fun. We'll be back. Hey, 
God, then get money. Two seconds everywhere, boss. Picking where one go by boo school, no, they follow Naira Mali Wakao. Here, what? You get why? Rat will die on top one bag of rice now over happiness killer. My, 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 say, me and my wife get problem. I no go tell Reverend Father for advice. Because Reverend Father never married. No, no problem with woman they give man. Here, what? Oh. I seen a person where poverty one key go tell you say washing machine they take load. Person where they push no they select toilet. What you want select? Bless you no no say person where they person where they push they sweat for forehead. Any toilet they okay? Cause the anointing is upon your life. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Passion is my name. AKA Titus. That's what's up. We've been having a, a lot of problems in the country and we hope everything is gonna be fine. I uh, remember during the lockdown. Uh, Two hundred dollars. Ah, now I know they speak English. <laughs> I remember during the lockdown, uh, they told us not to come out. That we should stay. We stayed indoors for two months plus. Nigerians are very strong people. Um, that period, I was trying to go out to go see one of my friends, get some things. Uh, I realized that for me to cross policemen, you need to have a very powerful English. Except you have a letter from a company telling you that you have a time outside. Maybe you work in a radio station. But if you don't have any letter, my brother, you need to have an English that will confuse you and also confuse the police. Now to go stay for bust of the foundationary to the problem. Now, sir, they come out. Allow, sir, nine police stop me. Pack! Can I see your letter of movement? I said, I don't have. So why are you moving when you're told to stay indoors? I said, I'm paramilitary. LLI 44275 regular intake, South and Kurama over. Police quiet. They say, Shama, they go. Now the other one, who in B? He said, person who speak this guy English, not supposed to be person. You don't hear this English for your life. He said, my brother, I never hear him. The way they look, this guy go past deep, yo. <laughs> Me, we, I know, sir, I talk rubbish. Those kind of English, then they use them two times, so. As you use them for Lagos, no try and for anywhere for Lagos, they will call their station, maybe they find the meaning. Go use them again for a bad one. After they try to tell you where police did it to get set. No use of Abuja, all of them are graduates, they are Lagos owned. Lagos owned. Even if one is for Lagos, no use for Lekki, use for Yano Sashi. More way, Bafo. If you drive for Lekki, LLI 44275 regular intake. Okay, when you're done with your rubbish, you can come down. Ah, okay. <laughs> yeah, something funny happened then. Ah. Shop right and spa, sorry. I was I, I live at Lekki. The shop right and spa close to my house is always the number one target whenever hoodlums wants to come. Like they don't loot that place, like they've looted, like they've looted and relooted, like it's Martin Luther King, like it has been like one man, like one man carry in Uber, in the drive Uber, they go. Now I see people they carry TV, washing machine. Now I ask them, say you know, shall let me. Now they tell her, palliative me, angry palliative. He said, ah, no, no, I'm angry palliative, you shop right. Now you go carry shop palliative for shop right. How, 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 who are not as a whole? Now you pack over, enter inside, go carry three TV. Two for a motor. He said, they go, they go. Now you start to tell her, say, you're a woman, I need washing machine. And you can enter, carry washing machine, put for good bag. Wait for go. The man just tell her, say, ah, it's a little bit microwave. At the blender. Now you go carry microwave and blender. As you come out, you don't see motor again. So you go. Microwave with blender far side. Later, police come the, come, come the wrong way, microwave and blender. They come the. Ah. Oh my, did you want to know? <laughs> what if I let him know I feel? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Sebastian, it's my name. Keep watching. You more hang out with Boss Coffee. Bra! Obrigada. That's what's up. Okay, we're back. It's Humor Hunger with Kofi the Guru. I've been having an amazing time off screen with my sister Taoma, one of the best comedians in Nigeria at the moment. Her skits, her stories, everything on point. There's nothing, no bad days, no bad skits, no bad songs, nothing bad. Everything just, <laughs> you know, and then she's, she's doing amazingly well. Um, Tao? Yeah. Okay, destination spot. Somewhere amazing you would like to go. Never been. Spain. Spain. Yeah. Mm, call Espanol. <laughs> <laughs> you have to learn. Spanish. I've been, I've been learning, trying. Okay. okay. Now, now you, know, you see, it's starting to look like you're someone who just sees a goal and you go. Yes, I go for it. I, I've seen it. Okay. Anyways, so, I wasn't like that. 
But when I started, I just knew that whatever you want, you should go for it. I, I, I agree. I do the same thing, but yeah. you're doing it more than me. I, I like it. Being a woman doing it is more inspiring. Every time I want to go for something, I don't care what you think of, I will go. I like that. And being a female making that happen, I'm, all other girls out there watching, this is your perfect influencer. You know what I mean by what I'm saying. Okay? This go getter. So if you're going to play football, you will go for it. <laughs> <laughs> no matter what, I know that if you aim to go to the moon from Nigeria, it might take a while. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you are using down for something. <laughs> <laughs> if you were to be president, where would you preside? And what would you do different? A president of Nigeria. I said, where would you preside? Which country choose your choice? I'm definitely not going to Nigeria. <laughs> definitely not Nigeria. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe an European country or something okay. that you know, you know, you have a say and all of those things. Yeah, on anywhere line, else. On the line, the world, they have a say. Yeah, like, Just you know, friends. there's a stereotype with women now that you can't do so many things that men, especially being a president of, I mean, of the whole country, maybe half shot. <laughs> <laughs> so it's that's the thing okay so i see that you're doing a court series what's next after this court series because you are you're pushing it i'm saying it yeah the court is actually a one-off thing okay I... yeah but i've been thinking about making a series out of it but i still do not think i'm ready to write a series i prefer to do one of one of talking about something a movie i still yeah, a movie. Yes, it's just me that's uh, slowing things down because of I agree with you. You writing, you writing stories. Yeah, I agree with you. you know, but the moment you start having babies, right now, you need to you know, strategize. Well, I know, I know. Which baby is that? <laughs> <laughs> but where are you from? Where are you from? State. Because when I hear your surname, I'm always confused until today you now told me. No, it's quite a stick. Oh yeah, break the camera lens with your surname. <clears throat> My surname is Akpao Kagi. That is a hand that is not restrict. <laughs> if it's not restrict, you use tractor to cut it off. Ab <laughs> That means you can't break a tree with your hands. Exactly. You can't hold it all by yourself. So. Akpao Kagi. A strong name about Kagi, you know. Okay, so I'm going to play my tongue twister with you, then go to a quote from my book, and then we'll wrap up the show. All I'm right, enjoying it. I could stretch it, but then we have a time. Okay. okay, so same for this season. Um, I know you're too brilliant, you're too intelligent. Um, if you dust me on my show, I'll cancel this episode. <laughs> <laughs> you trust me. So it says um, Friday, February 1444. Father Francis fried five fishes for five fathers from France. Friday, February 1444. Father Francis fried five fishes for five fathers from France. Hmm. Hmm. Father Francis, why did he fry fish? I don't know. <laughs> why do you know me? Why do you know me? Why? You okay? You don't like fish? This meat you like? Because I don't know. Friday. Isn't that, I forgot saying the, the song. You're yeah, entering character. You know, you know, you just changed your yeah. character. You're entering character. You're entering one of your characters. Friday, February 14, 44, Father Francis fried five fishes for five fathers from France. Ah. I've mobilized you. Ah, ah, I catch you. See, cram me. No. I and you, and so you're coming in, you're editing it. <laughs> See, you're editing it. Now, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, if it was written down now, it, it, it would be, it would be better. But you say Friday, February 14, 14. Friday, February 1444. Father Francis fried five fishes for five fathers from France. Three times you say it. Friday, February 1444. Father Francis five fishes. <laughs> <laughs> Friday, February 1444, Father Francis French, four fishes. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
You know, at this point, you know, at this point, uh, in this heat, ah, you know, you I, have, this slap would have entered. I was I, about to give you this slap. This slap would have entered. I forgot there are many fishes in my mouth. All right, people. I take a quote from the guru. Uh, quotes of the guru from the book uh, "The Scars That Made Me a Star." Um, yes, 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 yes. Oh, I like this one. And it is what Tao does a lot. I just opened and I'm seeing quote 156 from the book. It says, a little tease means no ill. A little tease means no ill. Little ill. And you tease us a lot. Yeah. Thank you for doing an amazing job. Your hands together for Tao, my name. And thanks for coming to the show. I have, um, what do you take, tea or coffee? You like tea, yeah? Yeah. I have a mug for you, a coffee maguru mug, Thank and some you. other essentials, uh, a mask and uh, wine and everything in the bag. Oh. Thank you for coming to the show. Thank you so much, Dad. God, God bless, bless you. you. Thanks for inviting me. Um, God bless. Watch out in one of these movies I'm making. I think Ta would uh, come and slap somebody in the movie. <laughs> Look forward to that. Thank, Thank you so you, much sir. for coming on the show. God bless you. Thank you for having me. Alright, that's been our show for this day. Watch out for the next episode. Another bumper package coming your way. Thank you and God bless you. I'll play that video of Tao way back in the beginning of our show. No, no. <laughs> I will show you a picture. In fact, I will show no. you. So this is the only episode where I'm going to show. No. Thank you. Thank you, sir.